Hello, number one sublimity. This is Mr. A. I'm here just to show you a few things that you can do at home. But first, I wanted to show you my outfit here. You can never be too safe on a coronavirus day 2020. I've got my tool belt here. That's got my Clorox wipes, my hand sanitizer, my Lysol soap, of course, my toilet paper. I got my gloves and my mask. I'm ready to go. I'm staying safe. And I just wanted to share some things with you that you can do for music and art while you're at home doing school at home. If you remember, we were playing our buckets. You don't have to have a bucket to play at home. You can have a pot and two spoons. If you have a bucket, that's great. If you have any type of uh, thing that will just sit there, that's great. If you have something to beat it with, that's even better. And if you remember, we have three sounds. Top sound, side sound, and the corner. But you know what? You can have as many sounds as you want. You can have the sound on the floor or the table. You can have the sound from the little edge here. You can have a sound from the handle. You can get all kinds of different sounds from this. So don't limit yourself to the songs that you're playing. If you make up something cool and we get to come back to school and you want to share that with the class, that would be so awesome. Now, remember, if you're wanting to play the songs that we've been playing here, you can always go to YouTube and just type in Bucket Drumming or Bucket Beats, and the guy that we've watched will come up, and you can watch some videos there and learn to play. Also, if you want to play the um, song from The Greatest Showman called The Greatest Show, you can also play that song. I'm going to go ahead and show you that rhythm we wrote on the board real quick. Here it is, If you there's A, B, and C. So if you want to play those, you can actually just pause the video right here and be able to see that while you play the music. You can get that song off of YouTube as well. It's called The Greatest Show. Now I wanted to share some other things that could be done while you're at home. The Metropolitan Opera. This may be backwards to you. Anyway, the Metropolitan Opera is showing the Opera Carmen until 3.30 today for free. A ticket like that would cost you well over $100, I'm sure, at the Met in New York. And that is metopera.org. You can go on there and watch the Opera Carmen for free until 3.30 today. Seattle Symphony is also uh, doing a live stream for orchestra, if you want to watch an orchestra play and watch all of those instruments and listen to them play together, that is at seattlesymphony.org. That is also for free. Just click on the live streaming button. Also, if you're more of an art person than music, you can go to Art for Kids Hub on YouTube. Art for Kids Hub. We've used that before here. You can also type in um, art drawings for kids, and there's many guided drawings on there that you can do at home. Uh, one thing you may want to do today, it is St. Patrick's Day. Happy St. Patrick's Day. I'm wearing my lucky shirt. If you're not wearing green, go ahead and pinch yourself for me because I can't get to you. Now, if you want to get on there and draw and we get to come back to school and everything's really um, calmed down, and we might be able to have an art show it's not looking very good for our art show right now, but if we get to have our art show, go ahead and bring in some of those art pieces that you've made at home, okay? Uh, remember, there's all types of things you can do musically. You can get on YouTube and type in karaoke for a song you would like to sing. You can play buckets, just like I was showing you a minute ago. You can um, do all kinds of things. Hum a tune. There's music lessons. Another good resource is to go on my website, which I've showed you before, my teacher webpage. And there are all kinds of different links on there that you can click for music and art. And don't forget, you can also do typing.com from the house and Nitro Type. I'll be on there maybe 
two or three times a week just, just to see if anybody is on natural type. And if you are, I will race you. Anyway, remember, these are, I want to go over our rhythms that we had for the greatest show. Letter A, remember we have three quarter rest and a quarter note which goes rest, 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 ah, right? So the song, da, 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 okay? Second measure, rest, 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 t ta, rest, 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 t ta. So you put them together, rest, 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 ta, rest, 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 t ta. Then letter B, we have rest, ta, rest, ta. It's all on the top, rest, ta, rest, ta, rest, ta, rest. Rest, ta, rest, ta. Now, the chorus. The chorus was always letter C, and that is the one that we love to play, but it's also the one that we love to speed up. We got to keep the same tempo going throughout. Ready? Now, remember that whole song is those three rhythms. And don't forget, there is one section where we modify letter A. We cut out the second measure. So be practicing that. Have fun with it. Your parents will love this. I can tell you that now. Don't, don't be afraid to draw something. But don't use all your time doing this. Make sure you're doing your reading and your math and everything that you need to be doing to be keeping up with your schoolwork. This is not vacation time. This is school at home. We're... It's something new to me. I've never seen this either. It's my 19th year teaching. And this is the craziest thing I've ever seen happen. Stay safe. Keep your hands washed. Have a great time. And we hope to see you again later.